Well, now to the new rules for NYPD officers. While they are out on patrol, the department issued a memo warning them against congregating and unnecessary chit chat while walking the beat. Linda Schmidt has more now on what's behind the strict orders as she's on the Upper East Side for us tonight. Linda. Yeah, hi there, Stephen Laurie. Well, this all stems from an event earlier this month. The mayor was at a street event here in the city, and he happened to see several police officers standing together at that event. So he went over to the supervisor, and he told them to spread the officers out. Well, now, two weeks after that, a memo is released by the NYPD ordering officers not to congregate and not to talk to one another unnecessarily. A law enforcement source provided me with this NYPD memo that went out Tuesday with an order for officers. Do not congregate or engage in unnecessary conversation with other members of the service while on post unless it involves necessary police work. The memo also instructs supervisors to make sure officers are spread out while on patrol. This is absolutely unnecessary. It's totally petty. Ralph Salento is with it, John Jay College of Criminal Justice and a retired NYPD lieutenant commander of detectives. I think his time would be better focused on the uncontrolled crime in the city. The fact that nationwide police recruiting is down 65% and that they're putting NYPD Academy classes in that are a third full because they can't fill the seats. There's nothing wrong with uh, having uh, two to three police officers working together or detectives on a foot post to protect each other at a very difficult time in our city. Paul DiGiacomo is the president of the NYPD's detectives union. He says policing is more dangerous now than ever, and there should not be a hard rule on when officers can gather together while on duty. It depends on uh, where you are, the crime rate on where you are, and the uh, circumstances of what's going on. Pat Lynch, the president of the largest NYPD union, issued a statement saying the order is unnecessary. Pretty soon there won't be enough cops left to congregate anywhere in the city because these miserable working conditions and the low pay are forcing them to quit in droves. Now, of course, I also uh, reached out to City Hall earlier tonight, and a spokesperson is telling me that the mayor always supports the NYPD and that both he and the police commissioner reached this decision because it's safer for police officers as well as the public. Back inside to you. Hmm. All right, Linda, thank you.